the decades-old Hubble Space Telescope is starting to show its age, and although it's reaching the end of its reign, and has been outshined in the past few weeks by the newer James Webb Telescope, it's still providing invaluable insight into the cosmos for us. NASA's revealed that not only is Hubble still working perfectly fine, but they predict that Hubble should remain operational for another 10 or 20 years. Interestingly, just a few days ago the James Webb Telescope made a strange discovery, when it found a large object close to Jupiter. The data revealed that on July 27, 2022, the James Webb Telescope took a photograph of Jupiter's Great Red Spot using one of its infrared cameras. For those unaware, the James Webb detects near-infrared and mid-infrared wavelengths, the light beyond the red end of the visible spectrum. This particular photograph has been making the rounds on social media though, as people aren't sure what the telescope detected. Although due to the photograph being very clear thanks to the James Webb Telescope's new tech, we can see that the object in question is in the shape of a cylinder, and that it appears to be quite close to Jupiter. If this is the case then it could mean that the object is thousands of miles long, and as of right now NASA or any other space agency hasn't catalogued something within our solar system that's this big. Some compared it to the mysterious space object to Muamua, an object that made its way through our solar system back in October of 2017, and which researchers at the time suggested may have come from another civilization, and that may have been artificial in origin. But although the two objects look similar, a muamua was only estimated to have been around 100 to 1,000 meters, or 300 to 3,000 feet long. What's strange about this photograph is that amateur researchers have said this isn't the first time that objects like this have been detected in the solar system, and it's led some to question why space agencies aren't investigating them further. In fact, a similar object was seen close to Saturn a few years back, but the explanation that was given for this object was that it was just a camera glitch, and that it wasn't a physical object. Oddly enough though, these objects were captured by telescopes on the ground, or even in some cases by amateur astronomers. This new object was captured by the James Webb Telescope's primary imager, which as mentioned covers the infrared wavelength, and this is particularly interesting because our eyes can't detect the infrared, the only way we're able to study this is by using instruments that can sense infrared energy. One user said the following, I'm not sure how glitches work when it comes to the infrared spectrum, but if that thing is sitting there then it's massive. I have no idea how we would even go about measuring it, but it looks pretty close to Jupiter, and doesn't seem like it's close to the camera. Hopefully NASA can investigate this object and give us an update. As of right now we don't have much information to go by, as the object itself was only captured a few days ago. It seems though that the James Webb Telescope is already capturing a variety of images that's making us question our place in the cosmos, and hopefully it can open our minds to some of the wonders that may be hiding beyond our reach. Just recently, scientists revealed that advanced civilizations and 1,000 nearby stars could see us. A 2020 study found that there are 1,004 star systems that have direct view of planet Earth, being in close enough proximity to see and study Earth, as well as being able to detect chemical traces of our presence. In a turn of events, instead of trying to find advanced life forms, researchers are now looking at what life could be finding us. Recent searches for other life have been focused on the dimming of exoplanets, as they pass between the star and the telescope that's observing it. Now, however, researchers have looked at which planets are aligned well enough to detect Earth, or more specifically figure out that we have life. Lisa Koltenegger, the lead author of the paper, stated, If observers were out there searching, they would be able to see signs of a biosphere in the atmosphere of our pale blue dot. Of the 3,185 star systems found outside of our solar system since 1993, 
Over a thousand have been determined close enough to and positioned accurately enough to perceive signs of our existence on Earth. This information has been provided through the Transiting Exoplanet Survey Satellite. The next developments in this research will come with the deployment of the James Webb Telescope. Scientists revealed they have big plans, and said they will study some of the exoplanets in greater depth possibly looking into gases within the atmosphere that could indicate life, such as methane or oxygen. On the flip side, however, there is the possibility that advanced life forms could beat us to the punch. If they had their own version of the James Webb Telescope, they could be making advancements to communicate with us at this very moment. Some researchers have spoken out about this in recent years though, saying that if advanced beings were to observe Earth, then they might determine that there's nothing of interest here, especially after seeing how we treat each other and how primitive we come across. Scientists have long speculated as to why advanced life forms haven't contacted us yet, but the answer might be that they don't consider us worthy of contact. If they were to observe how we treat not only each other, but also the planet's resources, why would they want to contact a species that lacks respect for their own? The search for alternate life has widened its possibilities in recent years, and as of right now plenty of unanswered questions lie in wait. So what do you make of these interesting photographs? Be sure to leave your questions and answers in the comment section below. It'd help us to grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.